The Green Bay Packers 2-2 hit the road to face the Raiders 1-3 for the first time at the Allegiant Stadium in Las Vegas on Monday night. This primetime showdown is a chance for the Packers to bounce back from last week's painful loss to the Detroit Lions and extend their winning streak against the Raiders to nine games dating back to 1990. Of course, the Packers also have the opportunity to face Devante Adams for the first time since the All-Pro receiver was traded to the Raiders in 2022. Adams remains an elite player, amassing 133 receptions for 1,113 yards and 17 touchdowns in 21 games since joining the Raiders. Here are five things to watch for and a prediction for Monday night in Las Vegas. Jordan Love's Opportunity even with David Bakhtiari out, Jordan Love will have four of his five preferred starters on the offensive line and a full arsenal of skill positions to work with on Monday night. Could this be the chance to see the real Love Packers offense? Coach Matt Lafleur has had extra time to prepare a game plan involving Christian Watson and Aaron Jones. It's crucial for Love to start strong, create explosive plays, and sustain drives against a defence that has allowed over 25 points per game this season. The Raiders' pass defence has been vulnerable, so this is an opportunity for Love to spread the ball efficiently and have his best game of the season. Containing the star power, while the Raiders have star power including Devante Adams, Josh Jacobs and Max Crosby, the lack of supporting talent could diminish their impact. The Packers must find a way to limit their influence on the game. Adams averages nearly 100 receiving yards per game, Jacobs is coming off a strong performance, and Crosby is a pass-rushing force. Can Jer Alexander and the Packers' defense limit Adams in crucial situations? Will the run defense step up against Jacobs? Can the offensive tackles hold Crosby in check? Exploiting the Raiders' turnovers the Raiders have committed seven interceptions in the NFL this season, with Jimmy Garoppolo leading the league with six interceptions. They've turned the ball over nine times during their current three-game losing streak. The Packers have a chance to exploit this weakness on Monday night. If the pass rush can pressure Garoppolo, the Packers' secondary, led by Alexander and Rasul Douglas, could have multiple interception opportunities. Garoppolo tends to make hurried decisions under pressure, and the Packers' defense is built to capitalize on that. Battle in the trenches. Both the Packers and the Raiders have struggled with their running games this season. Both teams are among the NFL's bottom ten in rushing yards per game. However, both defenses have also been vulnerable against the run. The Packers need to defend against the Raiders' struggling ground game effectively. Offensively, a stronger running game would provide vital support to Jordan Love. This matchup in the trenches could determine the flow of the game. Special Teams Impact Special teams can often make a significant impact in games between evenly matched teams. Rich Bisaccia, Casey and Nixon, and Dallin Levitt will be battling against their former team. Keep an eye on the Carlson brothers, Anders and Daniel, as they compete in the kicking game. Special teams could play a pivotal role in turnovers and field position, so the Packers need to perform better in this phase of the game. Prediction, Packers 27, Raiders 20. Many factors seem to favor the talented but inconsistent Packers in this matchup. The Raiders have a quarterback prone to turnovers, struggle to control the line of scrimmage, and rank among the NFL's worst in third down and red zone efficiency on both sides of the ball. While matchups involving Devante Adams and Max Crosby pose challenges, the Packers are finally getting healthier on offense, especially in the skill positions. This should be a great opportunity for Jordan Love to play efficiently the running game to gain momentum, and the defense to create turnovers. The Packers need to perform well to win against any team, especially on the road. But this is a game that Matt LaFleur's team is expected to win and play better. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to our channel for more updates and analysis on the Green Bay Packers season.